Well, there you have it, folks. <clears throat> As I posted yesterday, it wasn't Trump on trial. It was America on trial. And America has been found guilty. We have <clears throat> a judicial system that isn't a judicial system. It's a witch hunt system. <clears throat> we have a corrupt judge who does not follow the rule of law, but follows whoever's pulling his strings. He's a puppet. He's a, he's a pussy. He just doesn't uphold the standards and the, and the, the uh, rule of law and what his robe stands for. He is a clown. He is a hack. He is a disgrace to every judge in this country. And he has put every judge in this nation on trial. Every judge in this country can no longer be trusted. Every district attorney, Alvin Bragg, he's a racist hack. He only set out to do one thing, was to politically interfere with an election and to attack Donald Trump, and he has done that. He has put every DA in every state on trial. None of them can no longer be trusted. Your law enforcement agencies can no longer be trusted. They're all bought off. They're all paid off by Chinese corporate sponsors who are paid Hunter Biden, paid Joe Biden, paid Nancy Pelosi, paid Barack Obama. Every one of those Democrat pieces of shit have been bought off. And you saw it today. The collapse of the judicial system in America. The collapse of the political system in America. The, blacks, the collapse of democracy as the people's vote count. It's bullshit. So now what's about to happen? I don't know. But I know one thing. I don't think America is going to die over this bullshit. I think the people of America are going to let their voices be heard. I think the people of America are going to be sick and tired of these crooked politicians like Gavin Newsom in California and like the New York governor, like the Michigan governor, like the Maine governor, like the Illinois governor, like all of these governors who have their thumb up their ass and somebody else is manipulating their mouth because they're cowards. They have violated their oath to the Constitution and they're a disgrace to every American, whether you're a leftist or middle ground or a liberal right. They have damaged your country. And if you don't think so, prove me wrong. So I would encourage everybody in America who has an American flag right now, all across America, turn it upside down. Because this is probably the most gravest time with this, with this grievous injustice of our, to our country and to the people in this country. You know, I'm not gonna be like Robert De Niro and spout off all this bullshit about gonna take over and be a king, gonna be a dictator, because that's just stupidity. Robert De Niro, he's, he's, he's fell off the wagon someplace. He, his brain is fried, he's dead. He's a lunatic. But what is happening is the entire Constitution is being destroyed before your very eyes. So, you have an American flag? Flip it over. Everybody in America who supports freedom, democracy, who supports the Constitution, who supports the Bill of Rights, it's in desperate need now. Don't go out and riot in the streets like the stupid left do. Don't go burning blocks in buildings and tipping over cars because that's just stupid. It doesn't accomplish anything. It just shows that what the left did and BLM did and Antifa and all those bullshit pieces of shit did. It just shows that they are the enemy. Don't be the enemy. Be the Americans. Turn your flag upside down. Let the world know. Let your neighbors know that our country is in desperate need of patriots and people who love this country, and we will not submit to the likes of Joe Biden and his crew. If they come to your door and they threaten you, defend yourself as you see fit. The ATF, the FBI, your local law enforcement, if they're not 
there to protect you, if they're not there to uphold your constitutional and civil rights and First Amendment rights and your Bill of Rights, then fuck them. They're the enemy. They're the homegrown terrorists on this land. It's not the MAGA people. It's the Democrat Party right now who is destroying this country, who's got us set up for World War III, China surrounded Taiwan. We've got an endless war in Ukraine. They're talking about bringing UN troops to police United States soil. No longer a conspiracy theory. All those conspiracy theories that everybody laughed at and told you you were nuts and stuff about, well, guess what? They're coming to fruition. So it's time to get ready. And if anarchy is going to be the result of this pedophile administration that Joe Biden and his sick, sick culture of crazy, sex-driven, this is who I am, this is who I ain't bullshit crowd that he's even scared of, and his track record of being one of the worst racists in American history and politics, you know, done being the nice guy, not putting up with any of it anymore, and the hell with them. God bless America. God bless Donald Trump and his family. And uh, get ready. Get ready. America's falling apart. It's going to be up to those who believe in America still to keep it safe. As I posted before, it wasn't Donald Trump on trial. It was America on trial. As I've posted before, you can go back in my videos. Politicians don't give a shit about you. If you defend yourself against a criminal, the criminal goes free and you get thrown in jail for violating a criminal's rights who's out to injure you, steal from you, rape you, kill you, stab you, whatever. If you defend somebody else from a dirtbag criminal, the judicial system right now is coming after you as a good Samaritan. Everything is turned upside down. It's time to turn it back right side up. But I encourage you right now, turn your flags upside down. Let everybody that you know, that knows you, that sees your flag, know that America needs help. This is George Williams Sr. signing off. We'll see you on the flip side.